if you look back, we were always like this. We were always stuck with the mindset of survival. Even before the apocalypse, I never would have hesitated to fuck over the next guy. Different than it would have been now, but still, it's the same concept. I'm gonna need you to go find some supplies, I'll go find the route. What if someone's here? I got the gun. I never cared about anything, and that's why I survived so well now. I guess being emotionally disconnected from everything in the world helped. And then when the shit hit the fan, I could put a bullet in your head and then still be able to eat dinner. In a way, I guess you could say I show sympathy. <laughs> but you see, there's a lot of confusion between what's right and what is wrong. Seems like most people think that killing would be wrong. Me? I say to hell with it. All that matters in the world is me and my survival. If someone else dies, but I'm still alive and breathing, whatever I did is the right thing. Set a sign in your eyes. Set aside what you think is right, because being a good guy... <laughs> being a good guy is what gets you killed. In fact, the only time I ever showed mercy, it damn near did get me killed. Don't go too far. Whatever. So that's where you and I connect. But enough about feelings and emotions. Why don't we talk about how I survived? How you guys helped me survive. Hey! After I saved your life, well, hell, I don't need to tell you what you did. You alright, man? Yeah, thanks. That could have gone better. Dude! What the hell? He just saved us, man. We don't know if he's crazy right now or not. This is for our own good. I don't know, man. It seems wrong. No, he's right. The zombies will get him. Let's just go. All right. I woke up to the sound of a hungry growl. You know, maybe I could have forgiven you. <laughs> maybe we could have worked together. But the longer it took for me to catch up to you, the more ruthless I became. Damn. Now that I think of it, I really have become the worst man alive. I mean, the things I've done, the people that look to me for help, it's mind-boggling as to why I do these things. <laughs> 
deep down, I truly wish I could be the good guy. I wanted to be that guy who rode in on a white horse and saved the person in distress. But since I got screwed over so badly, I'm just the guy who kills that guy now. Over here. Puts the weak where they're supposed to be. If you have to ask for help, you might as well be dead already. There's three guys out there. They've been hunting me for days. They want what I have. What exactly do you have? Don't go out there. That's two. Oh shit! Nice work. Hell of a gun. But I guess it's not all your fault for my survival. I guess a man's will to survive can only take him so far. Sir, please help! I'm completely surrounded. I'm out of ammo! I need help, sir, please fucking help me, please. Shit! But I think I've clearly proven that I'm the top of the food chain. <laughs> I've killed so many people that I shouldn't have been able to kill. But I guess the difference between being a survivor and being me, I'm a killer. Oh my God, thank you so much. I survive because I have the mindset. I know damn well that I'm going through anything in my path, no matter how tough it might be. It doesn't matter what you've learned before this. You could have been the strongest or the fastest, but until you have the same mentality as I do, you're not going to win. Surprise, asshole! Oh. Fuck! And as we saw earlier today, it's obvious that I'm top dog. Oh, 
So it's plain, plain and simple. You two screwed me over. Left me for dead. It's ironic. <laughs> How the world brings the strong where they're supposed to be. And leaves the weak where you two are. When I first saw you guys, <laughs> I was ready to end you. <laughs> you have no idea how ready I was to take my knife and let your blood spill. I still want to kill you pricks. <laughs> See that? Those killer eyes. Damn it, it's got me torn. <laughs> you see, I love to kill people. Honestly, at this point, I just do it because I can. But the way that you looked at me, with no fear of death at all, this guy is the same as everybody else. He's just a survivor. You and me, we're the same. So this whole time I had just been dragging out. Do I want to kill you guys? But now you got me thinking, are you actually worth something? Show me where the deal survives. <laughs> fair to him. Fairness went out the window a long time ago. I did you and him a favor. So that's it. We in this together? <laughs>